Hey, welcome back. The next show we're talking about is combining two of my favorite things, competition and chocolate. So much chocolate. Food Network is about to launch a new season of Chocolate Meltdown, Hershey's After Dark. I spoke with the host, Sunny Anderson. If everyone's heard of Chocolate Meltdown, but I'm so glad to talk to you. What is the show all about? Well, the show Chocolate Meltdown Hershey's After Dark is pretty much in the title. There's lots of chocolate, there's lots of meltdowns, and we're at Hershey Park After Dark. <laughs> So it's set in Hershey, Pennsylvania. It's an amusement park. It's got a water park, rides just like a theme park and everything. And we have every single week, and this is four weeks, we have three contestants that we invite into the park overnight. So it's completely shut down to the public. And we let them run to the park. Actually, we make them run through the park to find their candy clues. And when they find their clues after riding these crazy rides, we send them back inside to what they call Chocolate World, which is their huge chocolate candy store there at Hershey Park. Mm. And we have them build gargantuan, huge, beautiful, scary, but delicious designs and treats for a huge prize of $10,000. And a year of candy from Hershey and a trip back to Hershey Park with their friends and families. So it's a lot of fun. <laughs> okay. Oh, I, I like, there are so many things going on here. It's hard for me to imagine. What kind of crazy works of art can people expect to see? First of all, I am thoroughly surprised. So the judges that we have are Ralph Atanasia from Buddy versus Duff and Monique Chowan. So they've seen competition like crazy, but specifically Ralph knows about what the confectionery crew can do and we have chocolatiers and bakers as competitors and they're making things that I could never imagine I literally just got goosebumps just thinking of some of the visuals you know uh, one was like a theme park the other one was like um, a weird kind of uh, operating room uh, asylum alien thing built out of like blown glass and chocolate i i don't know how they do it uh, but we give them a, a finite amount of time to get these works of art done and um, each contestant has their their friend or their sous chef helping them out because it's pretty crazy it's just unbelievable what these artisans can do even looking back now at the promo that's running for the show i still can't believe that these artists were able to make realistic looking faces and the texture on like denim jeans and things like that. Oh, of chocolate and candy. That's pretty okay. crazy. That is pretty crazy. My mom used to do, you know, patisserie and, and she was able to do like that stained glass stuff, the sugar. It's amazing to me, but it's something that not yeah. any of us can do. So it's going to be exciting to see it on your show. But I see you've got something behind you yeah. right there. I, I don't know if you know this guy, the skeleton. I mean... So are you a big fan uh, of chocolate and scary? Well, I'm, I'm a huge fan of chocolate. I made a joke, but you already know it's a joke when they offered me the show. I said, you could just pay me in Hershey's chocolate. I'll be just fine. Um, but I grew up collecting Reese's peanut butter cup wrappers like currency um, in that weird age where you just collect weird stuff. Yes. Um, yes. And, you know, it happens to each of us. And this is Bill. I say just pick whatever your favorite crew member's name is on set there, Honey Bunny, and name a skeleton after it because this is Bill. He's from the kitchen set. Um, and he's one of my favorite crew members. And when I got this in the mail last year for taping from home, we wanted the background to look very, you know, festive for Halloween. I thought, well, I'm just going to leave him out and call him something. So I picked Bill. I miss Bill from the crew. <laughs> yeah, but he hangs out in all seasons. <laughs> I love it. All right. What is your favorite Hershey candy? Oh, Reese's peanut butter cups, period. Okay. Hands right. my, down. Hands down. I love a Reese's peanut butter cup, but my favorite, when I went to Hershey town, I bought a box of score bars. I love a score bar. I love it so much that when my producer told me to pretend I was eating it during the segment, I almost ate the whole thing. And Hershey sent me a box. <laughs> All right. So you can watch Chocolate Meltdown on Food Network starting Monday, September 27th at 10 p.m. on the Food Network. And as you can see, Hershey's, they didn't just send me some love, they sent lots of love. Look at all this candy, oh my goodness. I'll tell you what, already the uh, Thanksgiving season is starting. <laughs> also, look at these socks, how cute are these? Thanks to Sunny and Hershey's. All right, we need to hurry to get to the next segment though because I'm gonna start eating all the chocolate and then you can go, you can go.